Here's my quick plan to earn $1,000 per day in profit in a business. This is exactly what I do. So to get this, you gotta get customers first, right? So the first and fastest way that I'd get customers is I'd call everybody in my phone contacts and let them know what I'm doing, why I'm doing it. So for me, I would start a seamless gutter business because I think it's a really freaking easy way to make a bunch of money. So I'd call everybody and let them know, hey, I'm starting a seamless gutter business. I need customers, I'd love to help you out. And they'd be like, oh, Kyle, that's so awesome. You know what? My mom needs gutters. You can go give her a quote. Okay, sweet, let's go. So I'd call everybody I know, and this will equal, let's say it equals 10 leads, all right? Then I'm also going to message everybody on my Facebook because who knows, we don't have everybody's phone number that we're friends with on Facebook. So I'll message all my friends and do the same darn thing. Let's say that that also equals 10 leads, all right? So now we're up to 20 leads. Now, I gotta figure out how I'm gonna sell some stuff. I have no idea what gutter is at this point. I don't, even, I don't even know what I'm doing. I have no idea. So I'm gonna go to the YouTube U, all right? YouTube University. I'm gonna go there and I'm gonna learn everything there is to know about seamless gutters. And then I'm gonna be like, oh, okay. I got, I, got some, I got some things here. I'm a pretty smart dude. Um, I know building a little bit, so I've, I've gathered some of this, all right? In the YouTube University, I'm gonna find a supplier and like learn what they stock and all that fun stuff. But then, once I know all that, then I'm gonna start calling subcontractors. Now, how I would find a subcontractor in the seamless gutter industry, roofers use gutter subs all the time. And specifically, they use Hispanic subs all the time because the Hispanics really struggle selling their services in an English-speaking in an English-speaking uh, country. So they sell their the subs. They're going to be anywhere from five to we'll say eight dollars per foot. So I know I just need to sell jobs for more than that to make money. The average job that I learned at YouTube University is 150 feet on a home, all right? So if I just sell for $1 per foot more, is that gonna get me to $1,000? No, because they can only do maybe like two or three of those jobs in a day. So let's say they can do, we'll go with just two. They can only do 300 feet per day. So in order for that to equal $1,000, I gotta be at least $3.30 more than what they are charging me per foot. But because I learned things on YouTube University and I found this Cowboy Cowan guy that taught me how to sell gutters, I'm like, oh, I can sell gutters for $16 a foot, but my sub is only, let's say six. I can make 10 bucks a foot? Well, 300 feet a day times $10 a foot equals three grand, just so y'all are aware. That's what I do. That is how I would simply turn my $1,000 per day salary job, I'm a mid-level manager working some corporate job, working 50, 60 hours a week, never getting to see my wife and my kids, I'd go out and do this. This is exactly what I do. And then I would add door knocking on, and then I would add maybe some direct mail, and then I'd add a sales rep that can go out and keep knocking doors for me. Then maybe two sales reps. Maybe I'd hire a 16-year-old kid to go put door hangers on a bunch of doors, right? Ride your electric scooter or rent a bird one. Who knows, right? You just go put door hangers out, right? R create the brand and keep making these calls. Keep sending these messages. Keep learning on YouTube University. Maybe upgrade from YouTube University to a program like Gutter Launch or Gutter Kings or something like that. And eventually, I'm going to get to a point where I've got so much work that I can afford to hire an in-house crew. And so now, instead of five to eight bucks a foot, it becomes 450 a foot or something along those lines, my labor and materials. Right? Now you obviously have a truck expense and all that, but you get to build the assets, all right? So I would earn $1,000 per day profit really, really, really quick. If I, and this can work for a lot of different businesses. You think about roofs, all right? Now it's hard to start up a roofing company and get a roof every single day. But a roof every single day 
this can become five, ten thousand dollars. All right, it can get really, really wild. There are certain trades such as HVAC, plumbing, electrical, whatever. You can't just go willy nilly start a gutter or start a business doing those because you need special licenses. But you could do similar to this with pressure washing. You could do this with window cleaning. You could do this with concrete. You could learn how to lay concrete. Um, you could do this with siding. You could do this. There's so many different things. Uh, mowing lawns might be a little tricky to get to $1,000 per day, but you could put docks in. That could be your thing. Go and put people's docks in. Go and put people's boat launches in, or not boat launches, but boat lifts. Um, there are so many ways that you can make a $1,000 profit per day inside of the home service industry. You just gotta figure out what, what you can get a little bit passionate about, what you have access to on the YouTube University, and what subs you have access to, right? Because if you noticed, none of this cost me any money up front. It cost me $0 to call everybody in my phone. It cost me $0 to message everybody on my Facebook. It cost me $0 to learn everything I learned on YouTube University. It cost me $0 to call subs and figure out what their, what their rate was. I didn't have to pay any money for this until I collected money from my first customer. How ridiculous is that? So I don't want to hear any excuses on how I could never start my own business because I could never leave my day job that pays me $60,000 a year. My family depends on that. Well, you work 60 days and you beat that, all right? Can you manage, there's 360 days in a year, to work one out of every six days, make this thing happen? Do you think one out of every six days you could, you could do this magic formula? If you can't, you're probably just lazy. That's it, all right? If you have that doubt, if you don't think you can, you probably can't. That's it. If you think that you can, I guarantee you that you can. Get out there. Win bigly so that y'all can give bigly. See y'all.